subscribes this week. Uh, one free hour of... Uh, oh, and we're already starting. Okay. Yeah, one hour of coaching in any form that you want. Um, that can entail, like, set analysis, detailed notes on players, mentality advice. Actually, like, session with me on stream. I'll probably be doing a lot of Smash this week. And, uh, yeah, I'll pay for your next song if you're dissatisfied. <coughs> So, yeah. Also, that offer stands to everyone that's still subscribed. Anyways, winners round two, Skitsu versus Akira. Alright, Skitsu electing to play his tried and true Ike. Akira sticking with Ridley. I've actually never seen Akira not play Ridley, so... <clears throat> Up to the top platform. You can probably catch that with an up air with how long Ike's up B, how to shield actually takes to get there, but... You've seen Akira play Mario? Interesting. I didn't know he had a Mario. Well, he's from Grandview. Everyone from Grandview has a Mario. I know that sounds like a joke, but it really, really isn't. Alright. Goes for back air uh, F tilt. I really like that. That's a... Uh, pretty sure back air is safe on shield, right? It looks like it. And then F tilt max range, it's really hard to punish with Ridley, I'd imagine. Ooh, it finally gets the Nair to back here. A little bit of a rough start from Sky, but uh, starting to do more uh, Nairs on his opponent's shield, which I really appreciate. Very, very useful. Confirms into a lot of stuff, and I think it's something that he could certainly uh, tend to do more of. Gets the Nair there. Unfortunately, misses the second one. And. Alright, Akira. Taking the second stock, little bit of, I'd imagine a little bit of a scare there, uh, almost getting hit by that uh, up B, which can kill you at zero. Though I'm not sure if it would kill Ridley at zero. It might, though. Knockback on that move is really weird. Alright, goes for Nair up air. Not gonna kill it just yet. The F tilt won't kill, but another ledge trap. How's it gonna make it back? Barely gets through the um, big thing of Ike's. What is that? Ether? Alright, another F tilt. I feel like Ike's F tilt could stand to be a little bit stronger, but the back here taking the stock all the same. Like, I don't know. How would you make Ike a little bit better? Because he's good, but still probably, like, mid-tier. He has stuff, but, uh, I don't know. What is Ike's big weakness? Like, speed, probably? And then... I wouldn't really say that he struggles to kill too much. But, uh, I don't know. He's very slow is the biggest thing, I guess. You can compensate with that by maybe having more solid kill confirms or maybe make him a little bit more threatening compared to a lot of his other other heavier characters I don't generally feel that threatened by Ike especially at ledge which is kind of a big deal especially in this game but last dog game <clears throat> Akira one big hit will kill that up air I'm a liar never mind uh, Skitsu's still at very low percent. Gonna take uh, a lot more hits to actually end this game. Although Akira well on his way, juggling him. 68%. He was at like zero, like what, 10 seconds ago? Gets the up smash. And another side B off stage. Ooh. Unfortunately, mistimes the fireball just a little bit, gets clipped by the side B, and that's game one going to Skitsu. But Akira doing a very good job keeping himself in this. Uh, now, I could certainly see if he cleans up a few things, him winning this set, actually. So, well done to him. And apparently, Ike's biggest weakness is himself, a 60 40 matchup. That's, uh. <laughs> that's funny. All right. I gotta sneeze. I really have to sneeze. It's like the holding in a sneeze. Oh, this is so terrible. And the sneeze isn't anywhere there. Fuck. Okay, it's gone. Fuck. No, it's back. 
Is it, is it back? Ah, oh, this is the worst feeling ever. Oh, this is so fucking annoying, dude. Alright, I think we're good. <laughs> you guys ever... <laughs> Sorry. You guys ever get that where, um... Like that feeling of needing to sneeze, but it's not coming? It's like... It's not painful, but it feels like... It's like almost that, like... Annoying... I don't think ticklish is the right word. But... Sting... I don't, I don't know. How would you describe that feeling, even? You guys know what I'm talking about, though, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Ready? And we got... E... Brawler. Okay. Sure. Um... I get to use some of the stuff that I see. That I just looked up on Ultimate Frame Data. We'll see how uh, true that actually is. I think he's using a little bit of a different setup from Johnny. He goes for the shot put immediately. I think that's me, Brawler's only projectile. And yeah, you can see like the difference in style right away. This guy much more content to be much more aggressive, much more in his face, which I imagine is something that me, Brawler, probably wants to do. How good he is at it, I'm unsure about. And he goes for a discount bouncing fish there. Yeah, no, that's... Okay, near... Interesting. Oh, wait. I realized I was probably miscalling one of the moves as, um... Uh... Last set as down B when it was actually down air. Other way around. Wait, you can just do that into jet. What? What is this? I'm so confused by this character. I mean, it seems to be working out pretty well for Skitsu right now, so. Off stage. Now, the problem is, how does this character kill? What sort of kill confirms do you even have? You got Nair, but does that lead to anything? Nair. Okay, uh, Nair deck Jason to up smash. Alright, yeah, that's... that That's just Fox. <laughs> that's really funny. Okay, what is that, side B? Goes for the one fireball. Gets clipped by it and buffers the Nair. That's gonna be a death. Almost, that, that is an SD, but more forced SD kind of, cause they get, it's the fireball that caused that, right? Cause if he just did the Nair normally and didn't get hit by the fireball, he was fine, so. Ooh, be reverse shot, but more shield damage than I thought it would do. Another nair. I feel like this character could actually be like irritating if you had more threatening stuff. Which he might with the right special setup, but I don't feel like uh, Skitsu is using one that makes uh, this character particularly threatening at this percent. I mean, best case scenario is what, he gets the tech chase up smash? He could have gotten it there, but I'm a little bit slow on the draw. And down B, I'm assuming that was down B's the other direction and can't make it back. Despite an early lead, it's starting to evaporate now because of that SD. Let's see if he can clean the S stock up rather quickly. That was a very weird phrasing. Ooh, air dodges through the shield, but uh, doesn't get anything off of it, unfortunately. And Akira's starting to run away with this lead a little bit. The what is that? Forward air up sm F smash? Does that work? <laughs> Goes for another shot, but still struggling to kill. Back air finally finding the kill. But 86%, one big hit like that up smash is gonna not be the end of it, actually. Wow. Surprised. But that dash stack will not be the end of it either. You like how I just keep saving myself on commentary? Almost as clutch as this comeback coming in from Skitsu right now. Maybe. Maybe. 
No, there's no way, right? It's like, no, not with a character like me, Brawler. No, nah, not when you're at 130 against... Not when you're at 130 against uh, Ridley, right? There's no way that this comeback happens, yeah? Not when you're off stage without a double... No, nah, not when you're, like, lagging against Ridley. Not when you're online. Not when you're shielding up smashes like that. Not when you're hitting the F smash, making the comeback, winning the set 2-0. Well played. <laughs> what the fuck was any of that? <laughs> This is the weirdest fucking tournament I've ever run. I've been running tournaments for five years.